sure that you are following me on my Instagram account because I am super active there. <laughs> Hey guys, what's up? This is Saloni and welcome or welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys the beginner's makeup kit. I am super excited for this video because I really wanted to make this video from a long time and I've been collecting products and I've been trying them. Today, finally I'm making this video because I have shortlisted some amazing products for you guys. So if you are a beginner and if you are looking for a full beginner makeup kit, then this video is for you. They are super super affordable so you don't have to dig a hole in your pocket for someone who wants to start doing makeup or who just want to groom yourself and you just want to buy products but you are confused which products to buy, which brands to buy. Your girl is here. I'm going to be happy with that. So I'm going to be showing you guys all the products which a beginner needs and all the products which are super affordable. They are of high quality. If I'm not saying that super affordable, bold you, then I'm going to be showing you guys very cheap and very bad quality products. I have personally tried all of them and they have worked amazingly for me. Also guys, if you are coming first time to my channel, please consider subscribing and you can also follow me on my Instagram account here. Now without any further ado, let's just get into the video. Okay guys, so starting with preparing our skin for the makeup. So if you guys know me, you know that how much I love moisturizers. Moisturize our skin before the makeup is really really important because how you prepare your skin, you depend on your makeup. So for today, I have used this Pond's Light Moisturizer. I am not going to go in that much into skincare today because this video is especially focused for makeup products. And one more thing which I like to do is that after the moisturizer, I like to leave it for at least 2-3 minutes so that it can get absorbed into the skin properly and your skin will moisturize properly. One more thing if you are doing your makeup in daytime, so one more step is included in that, that is the sunscreen. Don't forget to apply sunscreen on your face before the makeup and leave it for like 10-15 minutes. After that you can safely apply your makeup. Moving on to the next step, next step is primer and I am using this Nykaa Prep Me Up Primer here. It blurs out your open pores and fine lines. So if you have open pores, it is very important to use a primer before your makeup. Also, it it really like smooths the application of foundation. So primer is a must for your makeup kit. This one is from Nykaa. This one I got for rupees 300 or 400 something. I don't know the exact price, but I will mention it somewhere here. And I will mention all the products in the description box below so that you can easily find them. So we have to take a very small amount. We don't need to take too much of primer because this is not a moisturizer. We just need a very small amount like just a itnasa. Now I'm just going to rub it into my fingers and I'm going to apply it where I have large pores. Okay, now primer is done. We will move on to the foundation and I think I should prime my hair. Okay guys, for the foundation, I have a very good option for you guys. This is the foundation which I have been using. This is from Maybelline Fit Me and this is the shade 128 Warm Nude. If you are confused and if you are just starting with the makeup, if you have never done any makeup, then I will recommend you to buy this one. This one is really really good. When I started to make up, I took this one first. And I am still using this because this is so good. One more thing about this foundation is uh, this is a matte foundation. So if you are someone who wants glowy and dewy look, so what you can do is you can mix it with moisturizer and mix it with it. So it will not look matte and your look will be a little dewy. One more thing about this foundation is this is super affordable. Like this is a big pack that costs you around 467 rupees but this one is only for 299 rupees which is super super affordable and anyone you can buy it so I'll just I'm just gonna use this on my face one more thing just don't apply too much foundation in the starting just apply a little bit and if you want to build more coverage you can like always apply a second layer now i'm gonna be using this beauty blender this is from pack and this is my first beauty blender and i'm still using this i just love the quality of this beauty blender
करेक्ट ब्यूटी ब्लैंडर एंड अ करेक्ट ब्रश इज समथिंग विच इज़ गन मेक योर ब्रेक योर मेकअप लुक सो इफ़ यू वॉन्ट यू कैन ऑलवेज गो फॉर अ ब्रश बट बट आई लाइक टू यूज़ अ ब्यूटी ब्लैंडर बिकॉज इट रियली स्मूद इज आउट द एप्लीकेशन एंड बहुत ही ईजी होता है इससे ब्लैंड करना ओके गाइज द फाउंडेशन इज डन एंड एज यू एज कैन सी इट हैज़ ऑलमोस्ट कवर्ड एवरी थिंग ऑन माई फेस लाइक द डार्क सर्कल्स एंड एवरी थिंग सो कंसीलर की भी जरूरत नहीं लग रही है बट इन टू डेज वीडियो आई एम गन बी इंक्लूडिंग ऑल द प्रोडक्ट्स सो दैट्स वाई टू शो यू वाइज आई एम गन बी अपलाइंग कंसीलर यूजली अगर फाउंडेशन से ही मेरा पूरा कवरेज मिल जाता है मुझे सो आई डोंट अप्लाई कंसीलर ऑन अ रेगुलर बेसिस फॉर कंसीलर आई हैव टू ऑप्शन फॉर यू गाइज so this one is from Ellie Girl Pro Concealer and I am in the shade pure beige this one is amazing full coverage concealer if you are someone who has huge amount of dark circles this one is really good for you one more concealer which I have is from Maybelline and this is the Fit Me concealer this one is also very very good but this is a medium coverage concealer and this is very lightweight today I'm going to be applying this one this is from Ellie Girl Pro Conceal So I'm just gonna apply a little bit under my eye area where I have some dark. Also, if you want to enhance your features, you can use this on the high points of your face like this. I like to blend it lightly with my finger first, and then I'm gonna be using the beauty blender. Now I'm gonna be taking again this beauty blender, and I'm just going to lightly dab it wherever I have applied the concealer. Uh, one more thing: always look up when you're blending the concealer because this will not create crease lines under your eyes. Now we are done with the concealer. Now it's time to set it. So it is really important to set your concealer and foundation in place so that it can stay longer on your face. For setting your base, I have two options for you guys. These are the two options, and they both are from Maybelline. One is the loose powder, and the other one is the compact. I think loose powder is better than compact powder. But if you are a beginner and you don't want to spend that much money on loose powder, then you can just go for this one. One more thing, guys. I'm not going to use it all over my face because I have already applied the matte foundation. And if I use it on my ये वाला लूज पाउडर लगा लूँगी तो बहुत ज़्यादा पाउडरी एंड मैट फेस हो जाएगा, विच आई रियली डोंट लाइक सो आई एम जस्ट गन अप्लाई इट अंडर माय आई एरिया लाइक वेयर आई अप्लाइड द कंसीलर Now we are almost done with the base. Only two things are left: contouring and blush. So if you are a beginner and you really don't want to go that much into makeup, you need to buy a bronzer or a blush. For a blush, you can always use a lipstick. Whatever lipstick you have, you can just apply it on your cheeks, and it will give you that creamy blush effect. And for contouring, you can use any like bronze color from your eyeshadow palette. So today I'm going to be using. A for someone who really want to go for the blushes, then you can. I had this one. Me, this is the nine to five blush. It's gonna dip my brush into it, and just gonna apply a little bit. You really have to be careful while you apply the blush because if the blush is too much, then it will not look very nice on your face. So just apply a little bit on the upper cheeks so that gives you that lifted effect. Also I really like to apply the blush on my nose it just gives very pretty effect Now done with the blush maine bahut thoda sa lagaya because I just wanted to show you guys if you want you can also use a lipstick always as a blush because that is what I do most of the time Now moving on to the eye area for eyes we are first going to go with the eyebrows and for eyebrows i have the affordable option for you guys the miss claire's eyebrow pencil this is really affordable i think i got this for rupees 120 or 130 something it also has a mascara brush it really like fills out your eyebrows and for this pencil first you have to fill the eyebrows just i just use this pencil and nothing else just fill in the gaps with the pencil and then we just have to brush it like just like that it's very very easy guys it's going to take you hardly 1 minute to do your eyebrow shadow palette i don't really like to spend too much on the eyeshadow palettes i don't know why i just cannot spend 
so much so i have this option for you guys this is from bet and wild and it has some beautiful colors aap log iski halat dekh ke lag raha hoga because i have used it so much main apne har video mein and har pictures ke liye yahi wala eye shadow palette use karti hu these are the colors which it has and it has the shimmer color also i think i got this for rupees some 499 or 599 which is pretty affordable because this is very very pigmented and this gives you very smooth application going to take a blending brush i'm going to be applying this color all over my crease area just to give it a base ko crease area pe laga liya hai can you see how beautiful the color is looking and it's very easy to apply this very blendable and very pigmented so if you are a beginner and abhi tak you don't have any i should apply this one this will work amazingly for you it has all the colors which you need and you can like create any look these colors i think bed and wild has four shades in these palettes and i am in the shade rose in the air now i have applied this color on all over the crease now i'm going to move on to the a uh, darker color so for that i think i'm going to go with this one here just going to take a smaller brush for that and i'm just going to take this color here and then i'm going to apply this on the outer corners of my eyes Okay so I have applied the eye shadow now we are moving on to the eyeliner so for eyeliner I have this one this is from Nykaa and this is the Nykaa Black Magic liquid liner this is very good and this is very matte also stays for a very long time We are going to move on to the mascara which is my favorite for mascara I have two options for you guys and this one is from Maybelline this is their hyper curl mascara and this one is from L'Oreal this is their lash paradise mascara it's not waterproof so you can just easily remove it and easy to apply on the other hand this one is waterproof so it is a bit difficult to remove it even with the makeup remover so i face a bit, little bit difficulty in removing this so that's why if today i'm going to be applying this one this is the maybelline hyper curl Okay, now moving on to the next step, and this is totally optional. बहुत सारे लोगों को काजल लगाना पसंद नहीं होता है So if you want, you can just skip the काजल I'm gonna be applying काजल also for today's look because I wanted to show you all the products. So here I'm using this काजल pencil. I'm moving on to the lips, and for lipstick today I have a very good and very pretty option for you. So today I'm gonna be using this Miss Claire's कहाँ गया नाम Okay. So today I'm going to be using this Miss Claire's lipstick and I am in the shade 47 and oh my god this color is so pretty if especially if you are a beginner you will love these kind of colors like nude colors are my favorite and they look so pretty even if you are not wearing any makeup you can just apply this lipstick and it will like look so pretty done with the lips also now the last thing is left which is highlighter and this is my favorite for highlighter i have two options for you guys and these are the two options this is from maybelline this is the master chrome highlighter this is very very famous and this is so good the another one is from nykaa it has different shades in it so you can also create some eye looks with this for today's look i'm going to be using this highlighter this is from maybelline so let's just apply it if you want you can also use a brush and if you don't have a highlighter brush you can just apply this with your fingers it looks like this and And this is so glowy like if you are looking for a good highlighter then just invest in this one you will not regret it okay guys so that's it for today's video and that's the final look i hope you guys enjoyed this look and i hope you guys find this video helpful if you did please like comment and share also please subscribe to my channel agar aap logon ne abhi tak subscribe nahi kiya hai and if you are coming first time to my channel 
please subscribe to my channel it will really help me so follow me on my instagram account here i have made a new account because mere purane wale account mein pata nahi kya technical glitches chalte rehte the kuch bhi features theek se work nahi kar rahe the to mujhe ye naya account banana pada so make sure that you are following me on my instagram account because i am super active there post there on a daily basis so you will get my life updates and what i'm doing on a daily basis i post everything on my insta we'll see you very soon in my next video bye It matters. That's all I wanna do.